What's up everybody and welcome back to Creating Creations. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a turntable. First off, you're going to need to draw a circle on a piece of foam board, then using a saw, let's cut it out. For this project, I am going to be using a 9 gram servo. First off, we're going to need to take it apart and make some modifications. After taking it apart, as you can see in the gear, we're going to remove a little piece of plastic that keeps it from moving around 360 degrees. After cutting off that piece off of the gear, put the back clever back onto the 9 gram servo. Now we're going to cut off the original wiring. After removing the original wiring, apply some solder to the ends of the motor. Then solder on two wires onto the leads of the motor. After that, put the cover back onto the back of the 9 gram servo and replace all four of the screws. Now glue the 9 gram servo onto the back of the foam board. Now I'll glue together two popsicle sticks and glue another two popsicle sticks onto the side of that. For this project, I'm going to be using a speed controller so that I can control the speed of the turntable. So now we're going to glue it onto the popsicle sticks. For this turntable, I'm going to be using a old power supply for a Wi-Fi module. So just screw the plus and minus of that onto the correct locations at a speed controller. Again, screw the two wires from the servo onto the correct locations on the speed controller. Now glue down the wire from the power supply onto the back of the popsicle sticks. Last of all, we're going to glue the servo onto the popsicle stick frame that we have made. Now I'm going to be making a support for the foam board using some popsicle sticks.
Okay guys, I am done with this project. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like this video and subscribe to my channel if this is your first time visiting. I'll see you on the next project. Good.